Thanks for tuning in. This is Sweet Cyclist. Today we're going to be reviewing the Planet Bike Bottle Blinky Side Light. So here we have the Bottle Blinky in its original packaging. As with all the Planet Bikes, uh, bike lights and accessories, they do a really great job in terms of packaging. There's no plastic to be seen here. You have this really eye-catching design and a very simple cardboard presentation with the light itself really prominently displayed. I want to thank Plan and Bike for providing this. This is a really cool way to get additional side visibility, especially when you're riding at night or even the daytime. So while I take it out of the packaging, let's go ahead and review some of the specifications. The retail price on the bottle Blinky is $20. It has six surface mounted LEDs, three on each side. And you also get their patented super flash as well as the courtesy and a steady mode. Run times on these go from 24 hours up to 100 hours in the super flash mode, as you can see on the specifications on the back. And as with all of Planet Bike's lights, they're all FL1 tested. And this one carries an IP64 uh, rating for water resistance and dust. So now with this off, you see the really simple with the box out of the way. All the instructions are basically printed on the back of the package itself and you get the bottle blinky. All right now let's take a look at the weight of the bottle blinky. This simply attaches underneath your normal water cage. So without any hardware this is 54 grams. Now let's take a closer look at the fit and finish of the Planet Bike bottle blinky. It's a really cool way to add a little side visibility when you're riding. If you ever ridden during the day or night you'll know that most cars won't see the cyclists. Even if they look directly at you, it's very easy for them to see right through you. So adding additional blinky lights and accessories is a great way to ensure uh, additional safety when you're riding. In terms of construction, you have a basic plastic backing here. And this will fit underneath your water bottle cage, so you have to remove that and attach it right above. The main light is mounted on the bottom portion here, so below the bottle cage. And it basically consists of one power button and as you can see, a transparent body. You can actually see the whole circuit board in here. There's two AAA batteries underneath this. On each side, you have three surface mounted LEDs. And to operate this, it's simply a click. So one press will cycle through the modes. You can't long press to turn it off. So there's no memory mode here because you can't actually turn it off without cycling through to off. This is what it looks like in off position. This is the super flash mode, which is pretty erratic. Then you have the courtesy mode, which is really cool pulsing. It's a nice way to draw a little attention without being uh, too uh, annoying. And then finally you have steady mode. The run times on these are really great. At the lowest run time, 24 hours, and then up to 100 hours on super flash mode. It's kind of counterintuitive that super flash would use less power, but because it's on less, the battery life is significantly more. Underneath you have the Planet Bike logo and simply plastic here. You see these two slots here and this is to access the battery. So I'll show you that here. So if I take a coin and just pry up on that, you can see that'll pop it out. Now if we take it out, the two batteries are included with the original purchase, so you don't have to buy them. We have a simple gasket that runs around it for the water resistance. And then the main body. So you should be able to do this with the mountain on the bike as well. As long as you have enough space to come in here and pry it on. To reattach it, you simply line them up again. And then click through and make sure the gasket is fully seated all the way around. One thing to note is that even with a few practice times, uh, this plastic does get a little deformed. So now let's take a look at the bottle blinky installed on my bike. You can see here it's pretty subtle. Even with bottles on, it's barely noticeable. And because it's screwed on, you should never have to really take these off. Light output, there are three modes. You have steady, a courtesy mode up to 27 hours, and super flash for up to 100 hours. I really like courtesy and super flash in particular as they really draw attention. So now let's go over the pros and cons for the bottle blinky. I really like that they improve your side visibility and they're so easy and convenient to mount that you just have to put them on your bike once and forget about it 
They also have really impressive runtime with those AAA batteries and super flash mode, so you don't really have to worry about constantly recharging these. The things I don't like about it, the brittle housing plastic. Every time you do the battery change, you can feel kind of deform, and I'd be worried about that IPX4 rating, possibly letting water in over time. Also, it can be easily obscured due to the low mounting point. It's better to have a side visibility light on your helmet, as uh, obstacles won't block it, but using this in conjunction with other lights, I think is the best combination. Uh, one other thing is the interface is a little bit strange. You can't do a long hold to turn it off. You have to cycle through the mode to get back to off. We've seen this with some of the other Planet Bike products, but it's something you just have to get used to. In terms of a final rating, I would give this a nine and a half out of 10. I think they're a really slick way to add some visibility without the worry about recharging or mounting. You can really put them on your bike and forget about them. So thanks for watching this review. If you like the content, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You can get more content from us on our website at thesweetcyclist.com, as well as follow us on Instagram at thesweetcyclist. This is The Sweet Cyclist reminding you to enjoy the ride.